ever noticed how when a woman gets sick, she still gets stuff done, but when a guy gets sick, it's suddenly a Greek tragedy? There is actually science behind this, and it starts with the X chromosome. You probably know women carry two X chromosomes and men only have one with their Y chromosome. And the X carries very important genes for the immune system. In women, one X mostly gets switched off in every cell to avoid overload. But there's a twist, because not all genes stay silent. Some genes escape this inactivation, like the TLR7 gene. It's a very important immune gene. This lack of inactivation means women produce more TLR7 protein than men. And that's like having extra sentinels on viral patrol. So when a virus attacks, women's immune systems go full ninja mode, which explains why she can have the flu, a deadline, a toddler, and still run the house. Meanwhile, your boyfriend catches a cold and suddenly starts planning his will. But this superpower also has a dark side. More immune activity also means a higher risk of the body attacking itself. That's why the majority of lupus patients are women, which is an autoimmune disease. The immune system is attacking itself. So the same TLR7 boost that helps fight viruses can go too far. So yeah, women are biologically tougher in some ways. Fighting viruses while birthing humans, that's pretty awesome. It just sometimes has its negative sides. Follow Snaps' podcast for science that makes sense.